What if the United States loses control of the skies? For over 70 years, America ruled from above. From the F-15 and F-16 to the Stealth Legends, F-22 Raptor and F-35 Lightning II, no one came close, but the game has changed. China's J-20 Mighty Dragon now flies with upgraded engines and stealth radar. Russia's Su-57 Felon may be few in number, but its design is deadly. And now Europe and Asia are building sixth-generation fighters. The skies are becoming a battlefield of invisibility and data. America's answer in GAD, the next generation air dominance program. A sixth gen fighter so advanced it might never be seen, even by radar. But technology alone won't guarantee air dominance. Why? Because warfare is evolving beyond pilots, drone swarms, fast, cheap, AI coordinated, hypersonic missiles that travel over Mach 5, directed energy weapons, cyber jamming electronic kill zones, even the best fighter pilot might be obsolete. NGAD won't fly alone. It'll be supported by loyal wingman drones, autonomous killers that fly into danger first, and they don't need to come back. But with costs projected over $300 million per jet and development races tightening, America's skies are no longer untouchable. So we ask again, what happens if the US loses air superiority? Tell us in the comments, will air dominance still matter in the wars of tomorrow? If you're into cutting-edge military tech and future warfare, hit that subscribe button and join the squad. We drop tactical knowledge like bombs, 